As a teenager, as a lot of teenagers, I listened to a lot of music. And at one point, I, I discovered these artists, they were using the studio as a tool to create these new soundscapes and, and create these new visceral experiences. I really got interested into those techniques and how they did it and what kind of gear they used and uh, slowly was building up, you know, a passion for that. My name is Rui Philippe, I'm an audio director on Siege. When I came on certain projects at Ubisoft, I was uh, hired for my film expertise, but I had a lot to learn in terms of, you know, how does the engine work. My objective uh, since the beginning was, can I listen to Siege and not feel it's a video game? In film, I have my Pro Tools, whatever, and I'm pretty much stuck with it. In video games, you can say, hey, I have a crazy idea. Can you code that? That just really makes it super interesting and also gives you, it opens up a whole bunch of possibilities. When I came on a project, there weren't that many uh, sound steps being done yet. One thing that was for sure was there's a lot of ver verticality in Siege uh, that needed to be fixed really quickly. You would have somebody walking over you, you'd hear him just like he was coming behind you. It was impossible to play without propagation. It was necessary to have that technology to, to help us so that you'd have more of a realistic representation of, of the sound in the map. When we started working on Siege, I was told by other people that had done live games, the game won't be yours anymore once it's online. Players, they become very vocal. They will give out feedback, they will give out suggestions. And it's really important to me anyway to respect that community. There's millions of people playing this game now and it's their game. There's some really good ideas out there. I think it's very important to, to take that feedback and to, uh, to, to act upon it. The Six Invitational to me is a major celebration of how it brings people together, how we have so much fun playing it, how we have so much fun devving it. To be able to create this big event where everybody can share their passion and that energy that comes from that, you know, it's, it's just a great feeling for everybody. It's a big thanks to our fans, it's a big thanks to the Pro League, it's a big thanks to the devs. It's a big thanks to everybody that gives to this game. Being on that big screen and, and kind of realizing once I had said yes to this, <laughs> what it implied. You know, I think it's, it's really cool that people gather around the game. We're just people helping out to make it happen. And just do what I do and, and, and try to make the best that I can.